<laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's the takeaway from that one? Like, do you even celebrate it? Like, every win's hard, but. <laughs> I don't know. Every every win seemed tough for us. You know, we got to battle from the start to the end. Even if we got a big lead, you know, we got to understand teams going to make a run. They're going to press up on us, you know, and we, we got to play through all the aggression and, you know, all the adversity. Were you happy with the way you guys stayed with it at the end, though? I mean, that was, it got. Yeah, yeah. and we understood they was going to come out, execute some plays. You know, we just trying to make it as tough as possible. Um, um, everybody shot, you know, um, you know, Doc, a great coach. You know, that's a talented team. You know, we just try to make it tough on them. How much did you feel that this was a yeah, professional effort? I mean, the end of the trip, I mean, these long trips, sometimes right. people just can't wait to get home, and they, they mail in that last game some serious mental toughness from you. I mean, this whole world trip was tough, man, from us being on the road, losing games we, we know we should have won. You know, that, that, that kind of dwelled on you, but we understood, you know, you don't want to go out with a, with, with a loss, going all the way back home. Got to dwell on that on a five-hour flight back to Toronto, but you know I think we 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 just we just felt the we just wanted it. You know, understanding these last couple games been tough on us that we we know we should have won, and you know this best way to end it by getting a win. Dwayne talked about it. We all know it's hard to play with a big lead. You know, human nature sets in. It just you know it's like money in the bank that dwindles all of a sudden. How, how tough is it out there to kind of maintain that focus when you have a big lead? It, it's tough. It's tough. You know, could you kind of get a little bit comfortable? Probably won't do a cut as as hard or you know make a play as, as hard as you would if you know it was a four point game. You know, you, we got to stay disciplined with that and understand we can't give a team no type of momentum to give them a rhythm to get going. How do you feel um, how do you feel the team did without Jonas in there and, and what Bismack did for you? Um we did well. You know, um, still got to clean up a few things, you know, playing small, get guys understanding their plays, the rotation, how we guard, you know, if we switching, you know, still got to clean up some things with that, but I think we did well. Doc had talked about uh, his concern about you and Kyle driving the lane uh, before the game, but Luis and uh, Damari had a pretty big impact. Can you talk about it? I mean, that's 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 what helped us out. You know, teams understand what me and Kyle are going to do on a nightly basis, but when guys step up like that, it make our job a lot easier. And, you know, they got it going and kind of opened up things for us to, you know, get fouled and get some easy layups. and. Easy shots, you know. We know we understand it's gonna to be tough on me and him every single night. So they helped us out big tonight. As an LA kid, you come home. How nice is it to win both of them here? It's only the third time it's ever been done in team history. Um, it's always great, you know, to come home, play in front of friends and family, and get the win, and you know, have bragging rights when I come home this summer. <laughs>